Something great for the following weekend. You can take five to care to benefit Happy Bottoms at the seventh annual Battle of the Bean 5K. We have Brad Ziegler, company director of KC Running, and Jill Gajkowski, executive director of Happy Bottoms, joining us now to talk all about it. First, Jill, let's start with you. Uh, tell us what is Happy Bottoms. I know because I've done a lot of work <laughs> with you guys in the past, and uh, you guys do a great mission here in Kansas City, but tell us. What is Happy Bottoms? Thank you. Sure. We are a diaper bank. So we work with community partners to help impact low-income families uh, by alleviating diaper need here in mm -hmm. Kansas City for those families. And kind of go a little bit more into it because I know a lot of times people can't get diapers with, is it food stamps? Yeah, food and, stamps. And they're a necessity that you have to have when you have a kid, but you can't get them easily. They are, yeah. Um, food stamps, WIC, those programs, you cannot get diapers through those programs. And one in three moms don't have enough diapers to adequately diaper their child to keep them clean, dry, and healthy. So we just, we, you know, help make sure that those babies have all the diapers that they need. Yeah, well, you, again, you do great work here in, 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 in town. And, 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 um, let us know all about the race here. Where is it going to be at? When is it going to be at? And how do we get more information? The Battle of the Bean 5K is at the Ranch Mart Shopping Center, which is at 95th and Mission Road over in Leeward. Okay, yeah. And uh, our host is Foos, and we couldn't do it without Foos mm -hmm. Fabulous Cafe. They, uh, they really are the hook that gets everybody there. Not that many people are wanting to get up and run on a cold January morning, but when they hear there's going to be Christopher Elbow <laughs> chocolates, roastery coffee, and Foo's frozen custard, they're uh, more than ready to yeah, join us. Yeah, that'd, that'd get you up and running for a little bit of something. So how did the partnership here come together between Kansas City Running and, and Happy Bottoms? We were looking for something to do in January. We weren't too busy doing races, and we thought, let's try something uh, that would be... Uh, a little bit different yeah. in the uh, cold weather and we'd heard about Happy Bottoms and the great work they were doing and thought it would be a good partnership because people could not only uh, help support their organization financially through their participation but also bring a bag of diapers with them and yeah. uh, that's a great thing. Everybody has uh, access to diapers and can help make their uh, mission a reality. That's awesome. So as we come out to run, we want to make sure everybody who's coming out to run uh, next weekend brings uh, a case of diapers or just a box of diapers yeah. or something just to help you guys Pack out as well. Pack of diapers, size four, five, and six we always need. We also take open packs when your kiddo outgrows uh -huh. that size and you still have a bunch of diapers, bring those out, we'll take well, them. Well, if we can't make it to the race uh, next weekend, how else can we go out to help uh, the folks at Happy Bottoms. Sure, you know, we always need cash donations. Mm -hmm. You can Venmo us at Happy Bottoms <laughs> or, or you can go online and make a donation. Uh, we also, people do diaper drives all the time and that's huge. We get a lot of diapers yeah. through diaper drives. Um, it's a big, big thing. Okay, and then uh, Brad, do you have any tips for us? I, so I try to run, <laughs> I know I can do a 5K because I've measured it out and run it before, but like running in cold weather. I'm not so sure I'm about ready to run and uh, you know what weather we're getting this weekend. So next weekend, <laughs> when if it's like 20 degrees or something, any tips for running in that cold weather? Well, the biggest mistake people make that aren't experienced running in cold weather is they overdress. Mm -hmm. And so add about 30 degrees to uh, what you think the temperature is going to be that day and plan <laughs> accordingly. Okay. And then also layer, you know, we'll uh, see uh, layers that have been stripped off during the uh, race and <laughs> people come back by. It's an out and back so you can pick it up on your way back into oh, the uh, okay. finish line and uh, just uh, go with it. Go to the race with the idea that you're going to have fun. You're not going to worry yeah. about running your mm -hmm. fastest time of the year, but you're going to help out a good organization and maybe get a chance to enjoy some chocolates and some uh, great coffee. You just about got me hooked on the roastery coffee and the, and the foos custard, so I'm all about that. So guys, thank you again for joining us. We can't wait to be a part of your event again. Uh, it is a week from Saturday. Mm -hmm. Be sure to take part and, excuse me, Take five to care and take part in the annual Battle of the Bean Run. It's Saturday, January 19th <laughs> at 8 a.m. at the Ranch Mart Shopping Center in Overland Park. For more information, visit kctv5.com and click on the Take Five to Care tab. Again, thank you guys very much.